global warming is brought to us by Home Depot Chan. The central idea is global warming can drive different species to extinction, thereby affecting the whole food chain. If you came here by car, a shocking fact is that cars release carbon dioxide, which is a greenhouse gas, and it blocks the sun's infrared radiation. As you see here in this diagram, which makes the earth get hotter, so the ice on the ice caps melts. The global sea level has risen 16 centimeters in the last 200 years. That doesn't sound like much, but it's causing major effects. For example, the golden toad has already, is already extinct because of global warming. There were sudden droughts and floods which caused it to be extinct. The species which is affected by global warming and its near threatened is the Arctic fox. It is best known for its white winter coat. Yeah, with global warming, red foxes are introduced into Arctic foxes' habitat. Here is the highlighted space is the Arctic foxes' habitat. But red foxes are in the US, in the south of Canada, but they are moving north. And red foxes are better hunters, so they end up eating all lemmings and hair Arctic. And also end up eating Arctic foxes. This is a food chain. If the polar bear becomes extinct, oh. Arctic foxes and seals will rise in number very, very quickly. Which sounds like good news for them. But they eat all fish, lemons, arctic hares, and all dead animals, and eggs and seeds. So they have nothing to eat, so they become extinct. Then other fish can rise in number quickly and eat all of plankton and also become extinct. Which only leaves us with seeds, berries, moss, bark and grass. In the future, of one million species will be extinct by 2050. Or also also, 15 to 37 percent of all land animals and plants. This also affects our species like as I showed you in the future. We have to act now in order to help slow down global warming down in order to help all animals on the planet to survive. It doesn't matter what you do to help, as long as you do so. You cannot expect the Earth to be saved only by specialists or experts. The Earth is in our hands.